Hi everyone, so in today's video, I'm gonna be doing the look that I'm wearing right now and I really like the way it came out. All the products that I use, I'll list them down below. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe, turn on your post notification, and make sure to like this video if you do. Um, and yeah, without any further ado, let's get on into the video. All right guys, so I already did my brows and one eye off camera. So I'm gonna just start on the other eye. The first thing I'm gonna use is the ColourPop No Filter Concealer in Fair 00. And I'm going to blend that out with the e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. Okay, so I'm going to use the Morphe James Charles palette. And the first shade I'm going to use is the shade Cola. It's this blue right here. And I'm going to just take that on the e.l.f. contour brush. The next shade I'm going to take is this shade called Playground and I'm going to take that on a Morphe M433 brush. The next shade I'm going to use is this purple shade right here. It's called Escape and I'm going to take that on the Bodyography Pro Flat Shader brush. And now I'm just using the Morphe M433 brush again with no additional product just to blend out any harsh lines. Okay, and now I'm just taking that same ColourPop concealer, my Sonia Kashuk number 110 brush. Okay, now all I did was just take the shade ring light, it's this shade up here, and I just used the Morphe M124 just to pack it on. And I just, I did it real quickly, um, just before it dries up, so that way it's more intense. And now with the same um, flat shader brush that I used earlier with no additional product, I'm going to just blend this just so that there's no harsh line. Now I'm going to use the NYX Epic Ink Liner. Okay, so I'm going to take this um, Real Techniques Silicone Liner Brush and I'm going to just start drawing out the design with the same um, ColourPop Concealer in Fair 00. Okay, so I just cleaned up any fallout using my Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water. Um, now I'm going to move on to the face. For primer, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Face Primer. It's the mattifying one. For foundation, I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundations. I'm going to use two. I'm going to use Amber Beige and Cocoa. And I'm going to just blend that out using my Real Techniques Blend and Blur Foundation Brush. For concealer, I'm going to use the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer in tan sand and I'm just going to blend that out with my equal tool sponge. To set the concealer, I'm going to use the Kat Von D Lock It Setting Powder in Translucent and my e.l.f. Small Taper Brush. Okay, to finish up my eyes, I'm going to use the Luxie 221T brush and I'm going to just use the same three shades that I use on my eyes. Okay, to highlight my brow bone and my inner corner, I'm going to use the C513 Crown Pro brush and this shade right here called Relight. For mascara, I'm going to use the e.l.f. Volume Plumping Mascara and I'm going to also um, pop on the Pure P 
pro eyelashes in the style bombshell. I already popped, popped on my lashes. Um, so now the next thing I'm gonna do is um, contour my face and I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Caramel Toffee. And I'm gonna use my uh, Moda Pro Pointed Blush Brush. For blush, I'm gonna use the e.l.f. Primer Infused Blush in Always Rosy and the Luxie 640 Pro Position Tapered Brush. Okay, to highlight my face, I'm gonna just use that same um, shade in the palette ring light and my e.l.f. Blending Brush. For my lips, I'm going to use the Ofra um, Long Lasting Lick Lipstick in Napa Valley. But I feel like this is too dark um, for what I'm looking for. So I'm going to mix it with the Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick in question mark. Okay, now just to set my face, I'm going to use the Cover FX Illuminating Setting Spray. All right, guys, so that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to subscribe and also turn on your post notifications. That way you get notification every time that I post. Also, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll be posting plenty of pictures of this look on there. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.